Hello everyone, my name's Cole Faison, and welcome back to Banjo-Tooie. In the last episode, we explored the oceanic depths of Jolly Roger's Lagoon. Ooh. Today in this episode, we're going to be getting the last four jiggies that we can get, and we're going to be taking on the boss of Jolly Roger's Lagoon. So, first off, I'm here because there is a honeycomb piece inside the seamy. I gotta get it. I couldn't remember where he was at. Yes! Hate ugh, controlling her. Alright. No, no, no! Don't run into it, you stupid bitch. Go into the warp pad. Oh my god. Alright, so we're gonna go back into Atlantis because there's something there I didn't do yet. And also, there is. Where is it? No. God, stupid swell bellies. It's here somewhere. Where are you? Don't look at me! There- no. I keep looking at the same stupid swell bellies. Where's the other one at? There is another... Seaman! There is another, uh, seamy. Okay, I'm just gonna find with Kazooie. Where are you? God! I can't do this with her. Nope! Where is it? Oh my god. That's not it. That's just another stupid one. Where is it? It's here somewhere. I know it is. I know it's here somewhere. Oh my god, he almost hit me. Dude, where is it? It Does it, like, come and go every now and then? Okay, you know what? Forget it. I'm just gonna go ahead and... Swim! I'm gonna go ahead and... No, I don't... that's not where I want to go. I want to go... Actually, it's over here. Oh my god. Just go. Stop. I swear if that thing hits me. Okay, we want to go in here because I did open this up and I never went in here like a dummy. The Temple of the Fishes. Fishes? It's actually fish, not fishes. That doesn't make any sense. Grammatically incorrect. Hello there. Oh, hi. I'm Chris. Chris? Not very pig-like, if you ask me. Actually, it's Chris P. Bacon. Oh, I see. What are you doing, Mr. Bacon? I'm on vacation, trying to photograph those lovely paintings on the wall down there. Sounds fascinating. Oh, really? Oh, it is. But these awful fish keep attacking me. Why not get a spear gun? This camera was too expensive. I had no doubloons left. Perhaps you could protect me while I'm down there instead? Sure. Right then. If you could just follow me down to the bottom. And look at his expensive camera. It's actually a Game Boy camera, which is really kind of funny. I mean, back then it was relevant at its time, you know, but now it's like, who the hell would have that old piece of shit? Alright, so I'm just gonna get right here, and hopefully this will work. Hope you're ready! Here they come! Alright, so we have to protect Chris P. Bacon, if you get it, if you actually uh, say his name fast. Crispy Bacon? It's Crispy Bacon, like, you know, fry my ass because I'm made out of ham. You know, bacon me up. Oh shit, oh shit, shit, shit. Oh, this is not what I wanted to do! Okay, hang on, hang on, I can do this. I can't let one fish at all attack him. I'm trying to be very controlling of this camera. It's the dragon. Oh, man, I hope there's no fish there. Okay, come on. Okay, it's, it's very difficult with this. Oh. Okay, I'm making sure. There. Please. Oh. No. No. Oh. Hurry up and take your stupid ass pit photos, whatever. I'm sure it's gonna come out all pixelated and shitty anyways with that camera. You need like a Nikon or a Canon or whatever. Actually, my brother has one. So to Black Man, he it! I think that will do it. I'm off back to the surface. Yeah, so somebody told me to give some British accents. So I was like, okay, why not? And so see, he has like a British flag on him. So I'm like, why not? I got all the shots I needed. Perhaps this thing I found earlier may interest you. Yay! 
Well, I'm off to get these pictures printed. Bye! See you later! Where did he come from? Can I escape through there? Oh. Alright. Whew! Alright, so... I'm assuming that the Simi is probably located in different files because... Um, last time I found him here, but he's actually not here. There is a Simi with a Jiggy in it, but he doesn't seem to be here, so... I think I might eventually have to cut to where this little bitch is at and hopefully find them. So, um, oh my god, I'm so sick of you little shits. I'm gonna step on all of you. So I think I'll go ahead and maybe check around, so. Oh, I knew it! He is here! Oh my gosh. I was thinking maybe he's by Humba Wumba. Alright, so there is... Oh, come on. God, oh, thank you. Alright, so this uh, kind of works out a little bit. So, um, yeah, I'm by Humble Wumba now, which is like right next to the Atlantis, so it's like not that bad. But we're gonna go ahead and do some transformation stuff. It'll be really fun. And getting in Wumba, like, her, it's so weird with this because when you go inside, she has her pool, but, like, there's still water up top. Like, it's so stupid. You have Global for me! Yes! <laughs> Do it! Nope. Alright. But she's like, jump in, <laughs> jump in Humba, Wumba pool or whatever. But we're actually gonna dive in. Wumba call this submarine. Use left stick to turn on spot and A for much speed. Press X for sonic ping attack or LT or IT for torpedo attack. Oh, really? So we're a submarine? How fun is that? So fun! What the hell was that? I like exit out all. I don't even know. I like exit up upward or something. Alright, so it's just really cool. We got our sonic ping attack and shoot some torpedoes at some bitches. Move it! I kind of wish there was a war pad right by Humba Wumba, but whatever. But, yeah, let's go ahead and do something with this guy. Get on the interact. Okay, I'm gonna be like, this is the war pad! I'm gonna go back to the cavern, Locker's Cavern. And, no, wrong way. So, I didn't really explore much over here, but all the way over here is a big, my big black asshole! No. Um, so if you try to go down here with Banjo-Kazooie Jam George will be like, no! You'll be crushed by the pressure, so we need something that can handle the pressure, which a submarine can do that. Got down here at last, eh? How about trying my little shooting challenge? Score 60 points, and I might give you a prize. Do you need instructions? No. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Alright, so... I forgot what these damn things are called again. Oh, shrapnels, right? <laughs> I can't remember. <gasps> so basically, we're 60 points with these guys. Obviously, you know what color represents how many points. So. So this is like really fun. Just a little shooting thing. Yo, come on. Forget it. Just... God, for some reason, it's still hard to control this thing, because I guess I'm so used to the torpedo now. The talent torpedo. It sounds like it screwed up my thing. And 16 points! Hell yeah! Alright. So I'll just do this for a little bit more. There's like holes through here, but there's really nothing here. <laughs> okay, so I guess since, you know, we're in Atlantis, sort of, um. I forgot what I was gonna say. Rats, you luckily scored enough points to win my prize. <laughs> I'm all tilted. I'm like, uh huh, yes, of course. Why wouldn't I have won that? Dumb bitch. Alright, so I looked up some stuff about why Kazooie asked if Elvis was in the UFO. Because for some reason, I really make too much too much sense. So I guess um, there's. No, I don't want to play this shit again. 
So I guess in Perfect Dark, which is another game Rareware made, there was an alien named Elvis. So I guess that's why Kazooie asked. And also, it could be because, I guess, Elvis Presley himself, there was, like, aliens or something surrounding him. Like, I don't know, like, when he was born, there was, like, lights in the sky or some shit. So there's, like, some connections with Elvis Presley and aliens. Um, but anyways, we already got three of our jiggies, so which is really nice. And all we need to do now is take on the boss. Davy Jones. Didn't I open this up or am I imagining things? All right. Oh god, let's go in. Sheesh. Hey Banjo, I can see a jiggy down there. Let's take a look. It's an up oak green rainbow! Lord Wu Fak Fak, self important anglerfish. What? Who dares intrude? Oh shit, on Lord Wu Fak Fak while he sleeps in his appalling. I was trying to cramp lock. I was trying to give a British accent. Oh, er, we've just brought some mail for you, Lord. Fuck. <laughs> Biggie. Oh, <laughs> I'm thinking of the big delight of me. You're going to steal my jiggy and drain my home. Think of crispy bacon, leaving me to flap pathetically around on the bottom until I shriveled up and died, weren't you? Something like that. Then a watery grave awaits you. I couldn't, like, get the British accent, so, like, I thought of crispy bacon, <laughs> and then I formulated it. Anyways, so... I never knew this, but you can actually be the submarine when you fight this guy, and it, I feel like it's so much easier being the submarine. So basically, you have this nasty, ugly-ass anglerfish, which I used to be terrified of many other children. I used to be terrified of this thing. So what we need to do is there is going to be, like, a little boiler here that is going to glue. We need to take it out, and it's rated E. There's blood. <coughs> Me precious boils. So we go ahead and shoot the shit out of his boilers. Ow. Why why get surgery? We can just pop the shit out of these things with the torpedo. Alright. Look at me, I'm so cute. Oh god! Okay, I thought his face was facing me. I hate it when it's like his whole face is facing me. Ugh. I think his fucking vagina flap hit me. Alright, so turn around. Which way are you gonna turn? I turn this way. Look at him. So he like shoots this electrical stuff out of his uh, little antenna he has going on. Um, but yeah, kind of easy. But with <gasps> but with Banjo and Kazooie, it's just it's very hard. But with being the submarine, you're like very fast. You're more swift. And like one time, I, like before this, I was like, can I like actually go in here as the submarine? Oh, he looking at his face. I was like, can I actually go in here as the submarine? And I can. And I'm like, oh my god, why haven't I done this before? Okay, so he shot the shit out of that. Look at me, I'm doing plastic surgery for ya. One more. There we go! Chris Payback, I think I- Woo! Have you no sympathy? Hitting a poor blind fish? Time I opened my eyes to see what I'm doing. So, open up his eyes, which means we're gonna shoot the shit out of his eyes. Come on. Oh, please, not my eyes. God, get out of here. Oh, I hear it. It's a... Shoot him! God. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah! No, get away from me! Oh god, don't hit me. Ooh, okay, one more. How many times are you gonna shoot that? Okay, let's go, 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 go! Get back over here! Show your little shitty eyes! Yeah! Crispy Pagan curses things to me. Things seem to have gone belly up. One hundred years of oceanic tyranny brought to an undignified end. Yeah, how that shit get stuck in your antenna? I don't understand that. 
So now he's just here. Oh my god, that's so terrifying. Holy shit. Ugh, 36 jiggies. Woohoo! You can actually, like, get close to him, and he'll talk. He'll be like, oh yes, this happens all the time. In fact, I quite like being upside down. <laughs> you can't actually get hurt by him still. <laughs> that mouth is terrifying, though. He talks again. Leave me alone now. I think I need some quiet time. I know there's another one where he's like, I put up, I put up a pretty good fight, you have to admit. <laughs> Or I have to admit to myself, I did put up a good fight. Do you know who I am? You're just an ugly shit fish. Do people eat you? Forget it. Oh god, don't eat me. Alright. Get out of here. What does he say? Do you know? I don't know I don't, and I don't frankly care. Okay. So, we are pretty much done here for now in Jolly Rogers Lagoon. There's three Jiggies that we can't get, and I there is another Cheeto page we can't get, so... Oh, we gotta go back to Wumba. And it is, yeah, here's the entry to Humble Wumba. Looks like a pussy hole. I didn't really use this ability. And you know what? I don't think I've ever really used this ability to kill the enemies. I think I just press it because it sounds cool. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, I didn't really go in, but dive in! Awesome. I want to be the submarine and just go to the town city, but you can't do that, which is why it's highlighted in yellow when you're the submarine. Um, but yeah, I think some also some interesting facts I found was um, Jolly Rogers Lagoon is actually supposed to be, I think, the main, I think, pirate city for Project Dream, which was, you know, the game that was supposed to be instead of Banjo Kazooie, you know, the beta. Not the beta, but what it was what it was supposed to be before, but um yeah. There's also some other stuff I can't remember. Town City What else is there? I know it is it was originally the Pirate Village from Project Dream. Yeah, see? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Everything else I think I already told you guys. Alright. So Let's go ahead back to Pano's Emporium, because he has something new for us. It's a Cheeto page! <gasps> Give me this shit! Hello there again. Hello again. How much- Oh, how much for the worthless old page? Far from worthless, my friend. I was told that page comes from the legendary Cheeto book. Are you sure? <laughs> oh yes, I'm afraid I won't take less than five doubloons for it. I don't get quality like that in here every day. So I see. Welcome back. The page is still available if you want it. I'm sure it would still be here next year. It would still be five doubloons. Do I have a sale? What do you say? Yes! Alright, friend. Let's see some gold. Show me that coin purse! A pleasure doing business. Please help yourselves. He's gonna go. <laughs> Break that glass, baby. Want to hear it? Ah, oh, so good. Oh. All right, so let's look at our totals. So yeah, we're missing one Cheeto page and three Jiggies that we cannot get. So, yeah, we're done here. Freaking awesome! Do I want- no, I don't want to open up the next world. There really isn't much to do now. I think this might be a shorter episode, but... yeah. Get out of here. Alright. Trying to think of something else, but I don't think really think there is much to do. So yeah, guys, I'm going to end off the episode there. So next time on a shorter episode, I hope this goes about almost 20 minutes. I've been making 30 minute videos just because like this game is so fun. So I want to I always want to extend it like 10 more minutes. Um, but yeah, next time on Banjo-Tooie. 
We're going to be doing the challenge, Jiggy Wiggy's Challenge 5 and heading into World 5. So, thank you all for watching, and see you guys later.